Well, Lord Bolton is in a, a difficult position. If Rob Stark knows he's losing this war and that his allies are falling by the wayside, the Lord Bolton definitely knows it, yet he's still loyal to Rob Stark, so he finds himself kind of between a rock and a hard place. As soon as Roos starts to believe that Rob's not going to win this war, I think he's looking for an escape plan. And also realizing that if Rob were to lose and to die, and the Starks have been essentially wiped out because, you know, Bran and Rickon are, are missing, presumed dead, well, that leaves an opening for a new Warden of the North. This scene makes us look at, at the, the other past scenes with Roose Bolton in a new light. When Jamie and Roose are having dinner at Harrenhal and, and talking with each other is a key chapter in Roose's decision. I should send you back to Rob Stark. Instead, you're sitting here watching me fail at dinner. Why might that be? At that point, I don't think Roos is completely committed yet. He's, he's trying to decide which side he's going to come down on. And he's been presented with Jamie, whose hand has been cut off by men who are ostensibly fighting for him. So he's concerned, am I going to be held responsible for maiming Lord Tywin's favorite son? Well, Lannister always pays his debts. I think Roos at that point started to wonder, what's the best way to manipulate this to my advantage? Bruce is really feeling out Jamie in that scene. There's a lot of careful dialogue in that sequence there. Is two men, neither one really saying what they're saying. When Jamie leaves Harrenhal and he tells Roos to send Rob Stark my regards, and Roos's last line to Rob is that uh, the Lannisters send their regards. You don't have to wait until episode 10 to realize who is really behind this. Although if you're caught up in the shock of the moment, that might not be apparent to you. In the book, is Jamie Lannister sends his regards. And that was actually the original line in the script. And then people started coming up to us and ask us questions. Nikolai, for instance, who plays Jamie Lannister, says, wait, was I involved with this plot? And then Bruce Bolton said, does this mean that Jamie was the one who told me to do this? And all these other people who read the script and who are quite immersed in this world were confused thinking that it meant that Jamie was the one who had orchestrated this, which obviously wasn't the point. So um, hence the, the minor change from Jamie Lannister to the Lannisters.